All right, we're going to use Google Docs for this APA sample paper here. Um, and I'm doing this video to help you set up your title page with the proper running head and page number. So here we go. Um, first thing that you want to do is just make sure anytime you're doing APA that you are checking that you have one inch margins. So we do. And the other thing that you want to do is make sure that you have double space. So this was set to 1.15, so we want to put that to double spacing. Um, next thing that we want to do is go to insert and go to header. All we're going to do here is click different first page, and then we're going to get out of there. And then we're going to go back up again to header, or sorry, header and page number, and we're going to hit page number, and we want to pick this one right here with the one on the first page and the two on the second page. And then once we're there, we want to get our cursor in front of it there. And we're going to type running head, lowercase um, or head. And then we're going to have a shortened title. So this is just a sample. So I'm just going to call it APA sample paper. But if you have a longer title, you would want to kind of shorten it, and that's all caps. Then you want to take all of this and make it Times New Roman 12, because APA needs to be in that. Now, we don't want the running head to be this close, so we're just going to hit Tab until we get kind of close to it here. Oops, that's going to happen. So there's going to be times where maybe that one drops down too low because we hit our space too many times. So once you get to that point where you've pushed them far enough apart, um, you're good to go and you can get out of there. So then you wanna go and get on the second page of your paper. I'm just gonna push enter to like get down there, but you, I guess you could do a page break too. And keep going. So now I'm on my second page and you can see I have the two here. I'm gonna get in there and click into my header and I'm going to just type the t shortened title, APA Sample Paper, in all caps. Again, I need to go and check that this is set to times New Roman 12. And I'm going to do my little spacing again where I tab it and just kind of make sure that it's all spaced out. Oops, I lost my two. Okay, so that looks spaced out. Now, if you look, and I scroll all the way down to the next page, you'll see that my third page clearly has the shortened title and the page number. I go back, and I can see my first page. It has the title running head on it, which it needs to have. So now we're ready to do the title page. So we want to take five spaces, five double spaces. So one, two, three, four, five. And once we have those five spaces, you can put in the title and we're going to center that. Um, if you have a really long title, that's fine, but I'm just going to call this APA running head sample paper. And then you're going to put your name and your school. And this is in the wrong font because, again, everything has to be Times New Roman 12. So we want to make sure that is set. If you really want to put the date, you could put that underneath if you would like. Okay, so now you have your title page, and you may start typing here on the second page. Um, APA does have rules about headings. So the first heading is going to be centered and right in the middle in bold. Okay, so this would be heading number one. So let's say you have three parts to your paper. Um, you would want to maybe kind of separate it. Part one, the analysis or the comparison. Now, if you want to add subsections, you would, with bold, but over on the side, you would put that uh, 
uh, title that you want to use. Oops, I spelled it wrong. That will bother me. I can't type. Comparison. Yes, that's right. And then we're going to get out of bold. We're going to tab for our indent. And in this report, we will. We don't want to say we. That's bad. So it's pretty easy. I think you get the drift here. Um, my It's Friday and my brain is fried, so I can't spell or really write anything legitimate. But um, it is pretty simple. So just if you need to pause this, go back, figure it out. This is how you want to get your paper all set up. All right. Good luck.